an awesome group of people in the room here, but also you've got another whole awesome group of people on the Zoom call. I think this too. Habiba helped me plan for my next five years. Some people you know from yeah. living here in Syracuse, and I guess some from not here too. Yeah. Okay. So you want to have a plan. Yeah. Um, and I think I heard um, somebody say earlier, you say earlier, for the next five years. Yeah. Um, but you also want to try and engage um, these people that you care about yeah. to support you in kind of moving forward. But so the main strength I see of yours is um, like building community on an individual level, but then also like community wise, like bringing people together. And I feel like the way you do that, what you're really good at, is. Connecting the people on a personal level and knowing what's important. Yeah, you just have a gift for building community. You're always inviting people in and sort of have a sense for when somebody might want to be invited. And yeah, we need more of that in the world. We can keep building and building and working towards goals. We can't do that to be inspired. Is Mike was attending college at Oakland University through the options program and applied to live in the dorms and. He was allowed to live in the dorms, and then right before he was going to move in, they said no. And so uh, he was prohibited from uh, living in the dorms, so of course, uh, we've got to fight that. And so uh, for about a whole school semester, uh, there was an advocacy, civil rights uh, effort on campus that involved uh, almost the entirety of the campus. Everybody uh, at Oakland University was familiar with this. Um, was one of the largest uh, movements of that of that year. Micah uh, coordinated with peers, students, and everyone on campus to uh, fight this a uh, civil rights effort that now to this day has significance in the disability rights community, especially in higher ed with these options programs. I think there, there are themes in Micah's life of when he sees other models of it, then he's excited to take on that. So making sure that you experience the, um, the idea that people were around you and you could have fun with them, so mainly the circle was to have fun. This issue came just for a job, yeah, and then it turned into I wanted to take more classes and be a student again. Is the idea of having a relationship important? Yeah. Okay. I think Mike is taking control over his supports and services and launching his self-direction plan and becoming a supervisor for his staff was a very, again, talk about leadership skills. When did that happen? 2015-2016. Uh, like, that close to my sister, or like my parents and stuff. I think figuring out how Micah is clear with who his whoever his roommates are about what their role is as being a roommate and Dan seems to have taken a different, it has, has taken that commitment in a different way that I've seen from other roommates. Um, so there are potlucks and some social events that have been important to helping Micah build community here beyond the school bed. Community. Going on the trip to Israel as a way to um, uh, take a leap. Um, and, uh, and that led to relationships, it led to a sense of confidence, it led to a sense of self. Um, and the sense of choosing independence over comfort. Clearly, this this part about relationship is an important part. It's been an important part for a long time for you, it seems. The idea of having a relationship, intimate relationship, is an important part. This idea of being a teacher is an important part in all this. The idea of a kind of home, not just a home, but a home life, is an important part, like actually having a life with others that you share and that kind of close and this faith community is an important part of your life your family is clearly important to you what seems like you're still working out is do you go somewhere to be closer to family what are some of the steps what are some of the things that you're going to going to start doing the idea is not that we we plan out every step for the next five years we do the first steps the important thing is to keep the process going every couple of months so that you know a year from now you're closer to where you want to be there's a shift in life as rich is just referenced and it's kind of going from fighting the world to building an ordinary life